Understanding in a gray area, navigating ambiguities in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore a very interesting phrase in a gray area. This phrase is used quite often in English, and understanding it can really help you grasp the nuances of the language. So, let's dive in and find out what it means to be in a gray area. In a gray area refers to a situation that is not clear or defined. It's used to describe scenarios where things are ambiguous, uncertain, or where there are no specific rules or clear decisions. Imagine a scenario where you can't say if something is strictly right or wrong, legal or illegal, yes or no, that's a gray area. The phrase comes from the idea of gray being a color that's not quite black or white. In many cultures, black and white represent clear opposites, like yes and no, or right and wrong. Gray, being in the middle, symbolizes lack of clarity or indecision. This concept is used metaphorically to describe situations where things aren't just black or white, but somewhere in between. Let's look at some examples. 1. Legal discussions. When a law is not clear about a specific situation, that situation is often said to be in a gray area. 2. Moral dilemmas. Sometimes, what's ethical or moral is not clear-cut. These scenarios are often gray areas. 3. Workplace rules. If your company doesn't have a specific rule about something, like dress code on Fridays, that's a gray area. You can use, in a gray area, in conversations to express uncertainty or to indicate that a situation doesn't have a straightforward answer. For example, whether or not to invest in cryptocurrency is in a gray area for many people. So, that's all about the phrase, in a gray area. It's a handy phrase to describe situations that are not clearly defined or are open to interpretation. We hope this video has helped clarify this interesting aspect of English for you. Remember, language learning is a journey, and you're doing great. Stay curious, and see you in our next video.